All right, guys, we are back today with just a quick little look of the all new 2020 Ford Explorer. Um, this one is the ST, so this is basically top of the line other than your Platinum, but uh, it's your sport disc version. Um, so we'll get started here real fast. I don't have much time, but um, I want to take you to the inside real fast and just show you overall what the new Explorer does look like. Uh, looking down here at the wheels, we do have 21 inch black painted wheels with your red calipers. That is a uh, package, I believe. And into your black paint, turn signal indicators on the mirror. You have some Explorer badging down here. Uh, so yeah, really sleek looking. You have your roof rails up top. Uh, just have your three liter turbo EcoBoost, quad tipped exhaust, trailer hitch. Here's your differential down there. This is rear wheel drive and type inspired. Um, so, again, really cool looking with this black on black. Typical Ford fuel cap filler. You have your blind spot right there. Keyless entry should be right there. Uh, checking out the interior real fast. You have your Ford Performance down here. Fully powered driver seat. Heated cooled seats, leather. Um, with your ST, you do get some bolstered seats, a little bit heavier. Um, told you on in there, but. Also, I would like to note these do have a fixed pedal to the floor, so that's really nice. Um, it's a lot more solid feeling when you're driving, overall more comfortable. Um, but anyways, looking at the door panels real fast, you do have some stitched leather over here. Everything's all soft touch, high quality type stuff. Um, some storage down there, power locks, power windows, power mirrors, power trunk, automatic headlights. You have your fog light right there. Again, power trunk, uh, gauge dimming, and then there's your little new Ford light switch. And then there's your gauges. They do light up. Um, the wheel is heavily bolstered, leather wrapped, and stitched. Really, really nice. Um, the station is really cool as well. It's quite a bit thicker than the regular uh, wheel like in one of those but um yeah everything on the dashboard is all soft touch really good high quality materials here um center stack heated wheel heated cooled seats um storage container up here and i believe it's a 10 speed automatic all your drive modes power parking brake um some more storage under here with the usb um yeah you do this one does not have the glass roof but um look at it, you have some storage over there under there, uh, stitch console, glove box is damp as well. Do apologize, guys. I'm all over the place here, but um, not a big fan of these little lines right here. But um, I think that's just part of the design of the dash. But um, yeah, everything is all wrapped up in this one too. So we'll go check out the back. We do have a sunglasses storage up here, home link. Coming to the rear, everything does follow through really nicely. Um, so you have some sun shades up here. And you have your captain's chairs. And um, same thing coming through the rear. Same materials for your seats. You do have kind of a console right there. And there's your controls for your rear uh, third zone climate settings and all that. And then up there. Then coming to the third row, everything is folded down. I do apologize, I can't get back there. But um, you do have some adequate room. Headroom is nice, and you have some speakers in the pillar back there, so. So we can pop the trunk on this one. I can't get it open, so maybe there's a, uh, a button I'm missing on this, but uh, guys, just wanted to take you through this real fast, so. As usual, guys, thanks for watching. We'll talk to you all later.